So I thought it would be fun to do a little bit of vegetable prep. So let's grab a clean plate. So yeah, we're using paper plates because my brother accidentally dropped the last of the regular plates to cut on. So yeah, I'm going to use a paper plate like I did yesterday for some vegetables. And yeah, I'm just going to wash off a knife. Now I'm going to grab the pack of peppers I grabbed the other day. So yeah, these are the pack of peppers I grabbed. And they're really fresh and everything, really hard, and yeah. So gonna give them all a rinse. I want to just cut them up all now while fresh. Um, it's already the, I think the 19th today. So yeah, I'll uh, I'll try to turn the camera around after if I can. But yeah, the bins are really stacking up of all my brother's stuff and dad's stuff, and there is just so much stuff now. Um, so yeah, these paper plates come in handy. Plus yeah, my brother dropped the other ones. Uh, but I actually ordered a set of porcelain plates, which came uh, bubble wrapped already. So um, I just left them in the bubble wrap, didn't even open them. Uh, but because they were so well packaged, I just left them in the bubble wrap. Because I'm like, okay, that's perfect. Then we don't have to worry about them uh, breaking on the way down. So yeah, let's give these all a rinse. So there is one, here is a yellow one, Is another red one. So yeah, let's run to that. Okay, so yeah, I'm just going to start chopping this up. Here, I'll try to turn this if I can a bit, but my hands are kind of wet. But yeah, I'll show you once it's all done. Ideally, a non-paper plate would be better for this, but... Here, I'll try to back you guys up so you can actually see me preparing it if you like seeing vegetables being prepared. Still feel like that's a, a kind of shitty angle, but.
Okay, maybe I can just move this here now. No, that's still kind of shitty. We are like running out of space now with it getting... Okay, I think this would be better. <laughs> okay, hopefully that is better and I can slide this way. Yeah. Don't really keep the end pieces. Obviously, going to be cutting this up. I bought it, but cutting it up for all of us. But I wanted to prepare it uh, fresh. And yeah, I'm going to save some for another day, as well as just have some fresh for us uh, today. I'm getting off that like extra white skin from the inner of the pepper that doesn't taste the greatest. Yeah, and I, uh, when my brothers make it for themselves, they uh, add oil and stuff like that, but I just eat it raw, because uh, the oil really adds up with the calories. Occasionally I will have it with just like a tablespoon of oil, but I, ideally I like to have it just raw. Going to throw those peels out on this side after. So we've been having a little bit of fruit flies from the fruit. Yeah, looking forward to trying out those porcelain plates later. But yeah, it's important to eat nutritious, healthy food, especially when busy. Oh, my brother and dad, the ones who are trying to lose weight, not my one brother, um, they have been getting fast food on some days. Obviously, I don't partake in that because I don't eat fast food. Um, but yeah, uh, it's just getting so busy that some days they've been getting fast food, so... Yeah, I just picked this up the other day because we were out of vegetables, uh, just to kind of help out. But also, I didn't eat the vegetables the last time I made it because my brother uh, drenched it in oil. <laughs> so I'm like, no, I can't with the calories because, you know, I still have to watch my weight. My weight hasn't gone above 200, which I'm very, very happy about. I've been consistently staying under 200, um, which was my goal once I got to 200. And then once I got under 200, I was like, oh, wow, I didn't expect to get under 200 so soon. Uh, but yeah, now I'm just focusing on, yeah, staying under 200 and then... If it continues going down, great, but if it uh, comes to a stall, that's fine too because I'm really just focused on uh, nutrition and just, you know, vitamins, all of that, and just being healthy overall. Uh, but yeah, my main goal is to not go back above 200 and stay under 200 because that in itself is like a huge, huge accomplishment. So just to starting at 260 and then to actually get to 200 and then under 200 and then maintaining under 200 since I made that video getting under 200 and then getting a little under that weight that I got to and then maintaining that, that's been like really great. So I'm just focusing on like maintaining and not going above 200 uh, and I have been so really really happy about that just to 
be under that 200 pound weight and be in the 100s makes me feel so good from where I started. But yeah, what I do sometimes is I just sprinkle a little bit of salt on top of this. Obviously make sure you're grabbing a salt that's like the right kind of salt. Um, you can get different types of salts of course, but just make sure you even read the ingredients on these salts. Because, you know, you want to be careful what you're putting into your body. And of course if you can, get organic when possible. Um, but yeah. And my coffee maker, it was like having issues, but now it's brewing uh, more of the way. Like for probably about four or five brew cycles, it wasn't brewing all the way. And now it is, which is really weird. Um, but I have the other coffee maker ready to go. It's a really, really good brand. It's Hamilton Beach brand. Um, so I will probably show that to you guys later on set up. I still ideally want to set up the new one right away on the other end and still keep this as a spare because it's like, this is a really good brand. But in the meantime, I'm really happy this is brewing fully now. So whatever was going on with it those few days, um, it doesn't seem to be having those issues anymore, so that's good. And then, can't remember if I mentioned, did do my last load. I didn't upload for a few days, so I did, during those days, do my last load of laundry. And then, that's it for laundry for me. Anything else between now and then, I'm just doing on the other end, because it's just going to be too... Uh, last minute. You kind of have to balance out, okay, like this is what I'm going to do uh, beforehand and the rest, you know, do on the other end, including like grocery type stuff, like what am I going to buy now, what am I going to buy later, so. But of course, yeah, all fresh stuff needs to be bought on the other end because of the uh, trip down, it would just spoil, but. Yeah, I did get the one box of cold cereal, um, and then have some oatmeal too, so certain things was able to get, like, ahead of time, but of course all fresh stuff needs to be gotten ahead of time, so I did get uh, one more thing of cheese the other day too. Uh, so just big enough to get through till the end of the month, so. And then we ran out of milk the other day, so I've actually been using, uh, cream in my coffee. Usually I alternate between cream and milk. Um, but yeah, we were, we ran out of milk, but I don't know if we're going to get more because it's getting so close to the day now, so... I've been using solely just cream in my coffee and like a pretty generous amount, but it hasn't been affecting my weight luckily, so that's great. I've still been maintaining the under 200 pounds. It's always like a matter of like dropping weight and then maintaining it and like, oh, will this certain thing make my weight go back up? But no, it's it won't as long as you continue the healthy eating, the cardio, and all that, so, and also not going too low in the calories, because that can actually uh, backfire, so making sure you're eating enough, too, and, uh, yeah, drinking lots of water, just basically what I always say, so, but yeah, I'm not a nutritionist or <laughs> expert, but I can just say what sort of anyone would say, so... Okay, let's see, it's 14 minutes, 43 seconds, so that's sort of how long it took to prepare all this. Let's kind of, like, move some of it over on the plate, spread some of it over. So that's three peppers worth here. Here, let me get my, let me put this knife in the sink and then throw those in. I'm 
give my hands a rinse before touching the thong because the counter is a little dirty here from some coffee grinds. Sorry I can't do some editing for this video. It's just like, yeah, we are kind of getting towards the end here with uh, moving, so... Okay, just going to dry my hands here so I don't damage my phone. Okie dokie, so these are all the fresh uh, peppers cut up, two red peppers and one yellow pepper. I think that looks absolutely delicious. So yeah, going to, it's very early in the morning. And yeah, the coffee is brewed now. Did a fresh batch today because it was time for a fresh batch. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have some of that. Once it's cool, pour it into my red water bottle later, uh, like I usually do for any leftover. And yeah, I'll let Giorgio outside already. And yeah, I guess I will show you a bit of more what's been done. So I kind of have it flipped to me. So. Sorry if when I turn this around it's kind of aimed wrong. But yeah, this is how high the bins have gotten now. I guess I'll see when I look at this after, but yeah. That is kind of how high the bins are, and they still have a few more to fill. I think my brother got these at Home Depot, these bins. But the other ones are just old bins we already had. But yeah, they still have more to fill of their stuff and they might need to get more bins. And then there's just some crates uh, way over there of their stuff too. Um, so yeah, and then my stuff has been already ready to go. I'm so glad I got my stuff done early um, because um, yeah, they've been just in and out of the living room walking around and it's, it, I'm just so glad I did my stuff early so then it's just... Um, less stress at the last minute aside from just the easy stuff like throwing the rest of my clothes in my towel deodorant and unplugging the fan so yeah that's pretty well it going to enjoy some of these peppers now and my coffee and of course uh, divvy some up on some other plates as well as set some aside um, for tomorrow um, yeah to kind of spread it out um, but yeah, because for me, my portions, I don't need like a ton of this all at once. Uh, but yeah, this is a, like plenty to split between all of us for a light snack. And then, yeah, this was just some fresh nutrition I wanted to prepare for us. And yeah, going to enjoy some coffee now. Hope you enjoyed seeing me prepare from, prepare some healthy fresh vegetables. Um, even yesterday, preparing some, and we just ate it raw. We felt so good after, and yeah. It's just uh, perfect for this time to eat them raw, but I eat them raw regardless because it's just um, so much, uh, well, at least I don't have to worry about the excess calories with oil and all that. Uh, but yeah, that is pretty well it. I'll show you guys the coffee maker um, if I can um, on the other end when it's like set up and stuff. It's really nice. And yeah, a lot is getting done here. So yeah. Okay, bye.